Once Fred made a bet with the musicians of Korn on which of them would sing naked in front of the audience. Durst won $500. Watch this video till the end to learn all the most interesting things about the Limbiscuit singer and see how he changed from his early age to now. Enjoy watching. Fred's childhood was far from ideal. His father left the family shortly after the baby was born. Frederick was raised by his mother, and their family was in a difficult financial situation. Living in Jacksonville, they were often faced with lack of money and debt. They had to make do in the attic of a church, surviving on alms from local ministers. However, fate brought a change when the mother met her future husband, a policeman. Their marriage became a new stage in Fred's life, in which he found understanding and warmth. Already from childhood and Fred matured creativity. He loved to sing and attracted the attention of others with his talent. Later, fascinated by hip-hop, he began to show interest in dance. At Gastonia High School, the young man continued his creative development, getting closer and closer to rap culture and dance. Durst even founded his own breakdance group, Reckless Crew. His parents supported their son and his passion for music and helped him purchase his first equipment for recording music. However, Fred's interests changed frequently, and he soon became interested in skateboarding. In this new environment, his musical tastes also changed, and the band's suicidal tendencies and Black Flag became a new inspiration for the guy. Subsequently, genres such as metal and hip-hop merged at the core of his work. After graduating from high school, Fred tried his hand at various jobs, including DJing at cafes and parties. Eventually, he decided to join the Navy. Serving in the Navy was a real torment for the LB vocalist. At the age of 20, Fred got married and became a father for the first time. The marriage broke up when he found out about his wife's infidelity. The musician severely beat her lover, as a result of which he spent a month in jail. Returning to North Carolina, Fred assembled a hip-hop group. Their first music video did not help them to get the coveted contracts with recording studios. The disillusioned rapper returned to his hometown and began a career as a tattoo artist to secure his livelihood. Frederick's path to musical Olympus began in 1993 when he met young bassist Sam Rivers. The guys were inspired by a common passion for creativity, and later fate brought three more people to the band – John Otto, Wes Borland, and DJ Lethal. That's how the famous quintet called Limp Bizkit appeared. With such a silly name, the band wanted to push the people who didn't want to listen to them away. With the support of Korn, LB started to tour. Limb Biscuit's 97th debut, $3 Bill Yol, was lowly praised by critics, but it was later named one of the 20 best metal albums of the year. Two years later, the band delighted listeners with the release Significant Other, which is still considered one of the best new metal albums of all time. This work brought the band widespread fame. During the performance of the single Break Stuff at Woodstock 99th, the audience tore down the fences and some people were injured. LB's most commercially successful record was their third album, Chocolate Starfish and the Hot Dog Flavored Water. It sold over a million copies in a week and hit the top spot in the Billboard chart. The music video for Rolling was filmed atop the South Tower of the original World Trade Center in New York City. It won the award for the best rock video from MTV the day before the Twin Towers were destroyed in the September 11, 2001 attacks. Durst was the creator of some of Limp Bizkit's music videos and was responsible for the stage design of its touring shows. When the band took a break in 2006, he began to try his hand in the movie industry as an actor and director. Fred's biography is filled with a lot of scandal and conflicts, on which you could write a whole book. Fred Durst entered the history of metal music and became one of the most charismatic and colorful performers. Watch these videos to see more fascinating transformations of your favorite rock stars. See you in the next video.